Today we're starting with Rouge, our leopard gecko. We see geckos for uh, several different reasons, but this is one of the first times I've done surgery on a gecko. Hey, sweetheart. <gasps> Hi, Rouge. Look at you, you little sweetie pie. Rouge is here because she has a mass right behind her right eye. Right there. It's close to the, the corner of her mouth, so she could have like an abscess. We've scheduled surgery for today to try and take the mass out. Hi, honey. You're on the move, huh, little girl? There you go. OK. In you go. We're actually going to have a gas mask we use for cats or dogs that we're going to close off and put her right inside of it. The idea is to get in and get out and get her awake as soon as possible. This is one of the first times I've done surgery on a gecko. You're such a pretty, pretty gecko. Good girl. They don't have actual gecko masks. My gecko nose through there. We have to improvise. This is my own little making, my gecko anesthetic machine. We have to be very delicate with how we administer our gas and anesthesia to her. She's a very small little reptile. She doesn't take much gas. Get back to sleep. Now that I have Rouge anesthetized, we're going to make a little incision over the bump and then gently work it out. Done, sweetheart. Get a little more. When I made that incision and she wasn't in a deep sleep, she let us know she was painful. All right, sweetheart. Take this just a little bit. And I'm going to get some lidocaine and put that right in the incision. That that'll help for some of the pain. Let's try that again. Warm. It pops out pretty quickly. <laughs> God, what is this? I just. I have no idea. It's not an abscess. At least it doesn't appear to be. That's good temperature for her. Because Rouge can get easily chilled, and her temperature is highly dependent on the environment, I'm going to go ahead and get a little water bed of warm water for her to lay on to warm her up. There she is. She says, oh, water bed. Because, oof, somebody punched me in the jaw. Got her OK. Don't let her jump. <laughs> Are you suicidal? No. Huh? She's under the influence of drugs. So what I'm going to do is look at my little foreign thing here. I'm going to cut it in half. Ooh, it's pretty solid. There's actually a small little section of it that looks like it's an outgrowth. Very interesting. Interesting. I'm no longer a virgin's gecko surgeon.